He's beloved back home in Belfast. But we're starting to wonder if home hasn't become the corner of 7th Ave and 33rd here in New York. Live from New York City, it's showtime! <laughs> they are chanting, singing, and bouncing as round number one is underway. Garcia, you're gonna get a steady guy. There's no special effects, he's strong. And he's gonna be there until you force him to not be there. So let's see if Conlon can force Garcia to either tap out or be knocked out tonight. Great eyes by Conlon. He weaved underneath, stepped to the side and landed a nice body shot. Good body shot with that right hand as he was able to get position from that southpaw stance and he places it again, does Conlon. And again taking that leverage and that angle to the outside. He hasn't gotten a knockout yet, but I like what, I, what I'm, I'm seeing. I'm like seeing improvement, I'm seeing growth, and I'm seeing a guy that may not be ready for a title shot, no. but he seems like he's on his way. Oh, I, I, I agree with you. Look at the domination but. with the power punches in the last round. 32 to 5, majority of that, the excellent body work from Mick Conlon. He's going to be coasting in for a very nice landing for a 10-round win here in New York. And still the undefeated WWE Intercontinental Featherweight Champion, Michael Mitchell. 